With Office 365, you get familiar Office apps like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. You get mail, apps for mobile devices, and collaboration tools for meetings, file sharing, and much more. Let's start by setting up with the Office 365 Setup Wizard. Select Admin. Choose Go to Setup. You'll go step-by-step step through adding a custom domain name, like Contoso.com, then adding users, one for each employee or partner, who will be using Office 365. Next, it's time to install apps, like Word, Excel, and PowerPoint on your computer. With a few clicks, you and your employees can quickly put Office applications on up to five PCs or Macs. You can also use the lightweight version of each app in a web browser, this gives you the power of Office wherever you are, and it's a great way to collaborate with customers who don't have the full version of Office. Now let's get our email up and running. Open Outlook and add your Office 365 account, which looks like rob at contoso.com. When finished, you can get to your email and calendar from your computer, whether you're online or off. You can also bring your email, calendar, and contacts from your previous mail service, like Gmail, Yahoo, or another web host. The best way to do this is using Outlook's Export-Import wizard to move the old data into Office 365. Set up your phone and tablets so you can always access your Office 365 email and documents wherever you are. Whether you have an iPhone, Android phone, or Windows phone, you can add your Office 365 account to stay productive anytime, anywhere. Now that we're set up on our devices, let's get our business documents in the cloud. In Office 365, you have individual storage and team storage. Your individual storage is called OneDrive for Business, and it's already set up. You and each of your employees can put your own documents there and treat it like your desktop or My Documents folder. For team storage and collaboration, start using your team site, which is like a private website for your company that only your employees can see. You can customize the team site however you like. Use it as your business intranet or as a place for employees to meet. You can even use it to collaborate with customers by giving them limited access to specific parts. There's a lot more you can do to boost your business productivity. Use shared calendars. Use groups to organize projects. Hold online meetings and customer meetings. And much more. In the videos that follow, you'll learn how to do all of this and successfully get your business in the cloud with Office 365. Learn more about Office 365 for your business.